So if somebody asked me um, what is a good way to help trying to stop the club making contact with the ground prior to the ball and I think we notice it more as well when we're hitting shots off a mat you can sort of hear it bounce into the mat first so one to uh, keep using more training aids we've got our piece of card that we used yesterday for the right foot and how we want the heel staying inside of the toe use the card again only this time if you take your your setup position put the edge of the card just in line with your right foot in your setup position Okay, so you give yourself a bit of space. Then on the way down, again, thinking about what we said yesterday with the right heel staying in front of that right toe, which is getting your pressure moving forward, we can then get to a point where the club can strike the ball before it strikes the ground, which is kind of the idea. If we're, let's say, spinning that right foot the wrong way, the pressure stays back, there's a really good chance you're going to hit that prior to the ball. So again, just something you can do in the back garden, giving you some instant feedback. And again here it's just going to give you that nice sensation of the club striking the ball before the ground so this is a good one to be doing on your on your mat here in the back garden